Hot News Governor urges New Yorkers to stay indoors as extreme cold weather blights the state to New Yorkers are being encouraged to stay indoors due to extreme cold weather expected across the state over the next couple of days a Governor Andrew M. Cuomo urged New Yorkers to refrain from going outside over the next couple of days unless absolutely necessary in a Sunday a Extremely cold air has blown across New York State, with wind chills as low as 40 degrees forecast in the northeast a Central New York endures a snowstorm with Arctic temperatures and wind in Syracuse as this man battles against the weather. Ben Jennings snow blows his driveway on Sunday in Glenville, New York, where 16 inches of snow fell from Saturday evening through noon Sunday. James Spanos pushes a cart of his belongings on a snow-covered street in Portland, Maine, during a winter storm. A worker uses a bobcat to clear snow from a sidewalk alongside Nantasket Beach in Massachusetts during a winter storm that brought snow, sleet, and rain to the area. The Arctic blast is said to be a particular concern for those living in the lower Hudson Valley area, where the rapidly dropping temperatures are expected to result in flash freezing on roads a. The winter storm has already produced 10 to 15 inches of snow in upstate New York, while some areas in the Adirondacks have had 20 inches of snow accumulation a. Strong winds are expected to blow the snow around, hindering visibility and covering roadways AAA. Cuomo issued the stay indoors message on Sunday and his office noted that the Arctic blast and rapidly dropping temperatures could result in dangerous flash freezing on roads. Governor Andrew Cuomo encouraged New Yorkers to stay indoors as extreme cold weather is expected to blast across the state. Extreme cold weather is expected to appear all across the north and northeast of the U.S. National Weather Service meteorologist Jim Engel told the New York Daily News that overnight lows would be about 10 degrees. By Monday morning, Engel said the coldest part of the day would likely be between 5 a.m. to 11 a.m., but that people shouldn't expect the temperature to rise above the mid-teens throughout the day. Wind chills would reap current forecasts have the weather staying under the freezing mark in New York until Wednesday, when the temperature is expected to rise to the low 40s a.a. Central and upstate New York have been blasted with about a foot of snow or more in recent days and wind chills of up to 25 to 35 degrees below zero are expected. Pictured a people, the comments below have not been moderated. By posting your comment you agree to our do you want to automatically post your mail online comments to your Facebook timeline? Your comment will be posted to mail online as usual. Do you want to automatically post your mail online comments to your Facebook timeline? Your comment will be posted to mail online as usual. We will automatically post your comment and a link to the news story to your Facebook timeline at the same time it is posted on Mail Online. To do this we will, you can choose on each post whether you would like it to be posted to Facebook. Your details from, published by Associated Newspapers Limited. Part of the Daily Mail, the Mail on Sunday Metro Media Group. Hot, I get fucking on your bitch, yeah, that, that, that. Looking up, open the park, pot, pot.